My name is Jason Park, and I am a filmmaker uh, in Los Angeles, but born and raised in Chicago. My love of film, I probably credit it to my mom, who loves action movies. She inappropriately took me to Speed when I was like five, and that was my first movie at a movie theater. And I mean, that's like a very spiritual experience for me. I actually didn't really think of film as a potential uh, pursuit until after my year as a missionary on the island of Palau. I was studying theology, secondary education, but after that year on an island, um, I think I ultimately realized that my true passion is in cinema and is in filmmaking, and you know I, I have to pursue it. And you're starting to be a preacher and guiding people to a certain religious path, you know, it is a very similar way of understanding cinema and understanding movies in the sense that it is a lot to do with empathy and a lot to do with a sense of individuality. So I say my early education really showed me the importance of truth, the importance of subjectivity and how that applies into storytelling and how that applies into character. You know, Mother and Memories of Murder are two incredible fundamental films for me personally. That genre bending in the sense of like it's a comedy, it's a thriller, it's a mystery, it's a drama. And that is also true with filmmakers like Park Chan-wook, Thirst, which is unbelievable. And then, you know, also obviously Secret Sunshine. Secret Sunshine specifically, such an incredible film for me, especially because it deals with religion and it deals with this journey of pain and discovery through spirituality in a, such a powerful way. So BJ's mobile gift shop follows this character who runs his own mobile gift shop out of a old beaten up red luggage bag and is kind of taking advantage of customers in desperate situations. And it's a comedy that, you know, really is just following a character who's doing something in an alternative fashion and is going against the flow of what I think most people in society are pursuing. You know, the film to me is is about Chicago. The character of BJ kind of embodies my interpretation of how the city is and its character and its attitude and its sense of proclamation of like, this is who I am and stands on their two feet and the hustle. When you're shooting your first short film, you know, I think there's so much aspiration and so much motivation to do the biggest, grandest story. And I've learned this doing three short films in a span of two years that, you know, the less you worry about money and the more you focus in on the core of what you're trying to do and what you're trying to explore and try to have some fun with it and try to make something that fits your persona as a filmmaker, I think it will always result in a much better film. You're seeing, you know, different types of filmmakers pop up from different regions, different countries, different backgrounds all the time. So I think it's really inspiring and it's really a great time. I don't want to just say as a diverse filmmaker, but as a filmmaker who has something to say, who wants to explore some things that is true to them, is, is real to them. Now is the time to really go after it and really pursue it.